Hey there guys, we're going to be going to Gargantuan Grub in the Sand Elite version on the global server. Uh, this is the Sandworm trial. Uh, if you've seen me do it from the JP server, you know it's a super easy trial. So all you really need for this trial is um, an evasion physical cover tank. Someone to provoke the single target stuff like Dispel. You don't want your tank provoking Dispel because they get Dispelled. Um, you want Mirage every third turn and a good breaker. And that's pretty much it. Also, you want to bring a way to poison the boss if you can. And that pretty much negates all the damage you take in this trial. And then you just work him down at your own pace. So we're going to be using uh, Save Your Lightning for a 90% Spirit Break. And because of that, we're going to use some Mages. We're going to use Shuyi. And we're going to toss in Ibarra as well. Just because, you know, we had, we had an extra party slot. So why not? Um, Fid is honestly here just because her Limit Burst is super slow. So it's easy to get that mission to um, finish, with, finish with the Limit Burst. And then Galoof will be our cover tank. So... Lightning is going to be our Provoker. We're going to shift on turn one. She's just mostly got some autofill in the base form. Uh, turn one, she's going to shift. Here's the shift form, geared exactly the same. Uh, full evasion, LB fill, etc. There we go. Um, Galoof is going to be our evasion provoker. He's got LB fill as well with Thousand Needles for Mirage. He's going to entrust just to make things easier. Um, Summer Fina and Lid are going to shift on turn one, and then they're going to be our source of good water in peril, as well as Limit Burst um, finishing mission. And they're using the Poison Whip for uh, poison. Ibarra is going to just chain pretty much every turn. Base form and shift form are pretty identical. They're just geared for insect killer, etc. She's got secondary gear. She's got 95 insect killer. And then Shuyi is going to be... Um, Chaining as well. We're going to stay in the base form. She's going to be the primary DPS. She's got 230 Insect Killer. And that's pretty much it. Like overall, you can bring really anything. This draw is super easy. We're taking Cotton C as a friend. Here's the gear. It's geared pretty similar to mine. 200 Insect Killer. Alright, let's go in here and get a super easy win. Unless they buffed it, which is always possible. But I don't think they did. All right, here's the ambush. They uh, they fixed they fixed the um, the field, which is real nice. All right, so Galoof will just physical cover on turn one. Lightning will shift, and we don't have her LB yet, so we'll just do. Um, we can actually use Fid to break this turn instead, so Lightning can potentially get. Uh, actually, let me let me break three times. So we can maybe poison the boss. Hey, we got a poison. Alright, uh, if we get crystals with lightning, then we can um, do a better break for next turn right away. Uh, let's see. So, weak. Oh, come on. So, Ibarra will weakening, supernatural, and, and cuckoo. Shuyi's. This first turn is mostly just set up. We're not really going to deal very good damage this turn. <laughs> and in fact, we broke the chains and everything. Whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and use Lightning to just ATB charge. That way we can get her LB next turn with the autofill. Yep, there it goes. And then the boss does Graviga every now and then. It's not going to kill your team, so it's totally fine. You don't got to worry about that. There's the Dispel on Lightning. There's the Poison. Alright, let's go ahead and do a better Spirit Break. And now we're going to start doing better damage as well. We're going to end Cuckoo four times. Uh, Shuyi will Merciless Waterfall four times. Let's have Galoof go ahead and Entrust to... Um, that's the right one, right? Yeah, let's Entrust to Fid. Oh, we actually don't even need to. So Fid will do a better Water and Peril as well this turn, right here. And then we'll entrust to Fid. And we will just chain a bunch. Overall, this draw is basically whatever. And as you see how uh, slow Fid's LB is, it's still going off, although you can't see it anymore. There it was, that, that blue hit. It was really slow. And the boss is super tanky, as you can see.
All right, so this on turn three, the boss is going to do um, uh, an attack that ignores cover. So we're going to use Thousand Needles to fix that. Let's see, Lightning will just ATB for LB. Um, Fable will just break again, whatever. And with his chain again. And there's... <laughs> we started Fizz Limit Burst before we even chained, and it didn't even hit into all four quad casts of Cast Wave Awaken was finished. Kind of funny. And there's the attack that ignores cover at the end of the turn, but we miraged it. Alright, so let's go ahead and put up cover again. We can break the boss again, and we just keep going on our damage. So we'll just chain again. And there's no point to use Fid, because we're not going to kill it this turn. So we'll save our LB. How much percent are we doing per turn anyway? Like, 11%? You actually got to be careful that the, the, the poison doesn't kill the boss before our limit burst does. Alright, Fid. Let's go ahead and put up poison... We'll just hit the boss three times. Uh, I think Ibarra... Yeah, this turn we need to use. So we're going to chain three times and put up her quad cast again. Uh, I think next turn... Yeah, let's do it this way. Next turn we do the cooldowns on... Um, I forget these units' names. We'll just repeat this. And just chain again. Yeah, this boss is <laughs> not exciting. Not exciting at all. Alright, so we're gonna... Um, did we poison the boss? I didn't even see. Preparing to use Sand Trap. Looks like the boss was not poisoned. Uh, so Sand Trap is coming in, so we're gonna Thousand Needles. We're going to break... Uh, Ibarra is now in the base form, so we're going to one, two, three, and then debilitate him. Uh, let's see. Oh, we need to do it this way. Okay, so this is basically a setup turn again. Lid will hit the boss three times to try to poison. Yeah, we're going to do a bunch of setup here. Uh, Blooming, Lotus, that. So these are not really going to chain very well. We got the poison up, so that's good. So it's looking like a, like a turn turn 8 clear or something. And then sand trap. And then poison. Uh, if I chain on the boss, poison would actually kill him. So, we're going to not chain much this turn. And by not much, I mean basically not at all. So, we're going to just erase you four times. Uh, we will just guard the Shuis. We're going to let the poison do its thing, and then we're going to finish them off next turn with a little burst. Because if I chained this turn, the boss would have stopped around like 4% and died to poison. And we'd fail the mission. Because we've got to finish him with a, finish him with a limit burst. Alright, so there we go. Let's finish it up. So let's erase you four times. Let's water four times. Actually, wouldn't be using her Magnus be stronger? I think it would be. Oh well, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. And we'll do this. So we'll send the chainers, and we will send the limit first. Uh, Fid, who is extraordinarily slow, and that's the reason she was chosen for this mission. Her limit burst is still going off, and at some point, Fid will finish with limit burst. <laughs> that's why she was chosen. That was her one and only duty. This fight was to have a very, very slow hitting limit burst. We didn't have to do this fight twice. 
And of course, you can use any one you want with a slow hitting limit burst. So, there was the Sandworm Trial. And now, we're going to finish out this video with a quick ten pull. Just for the sake of it, because why not? We'll do two things in one video. We've got a weekly pull, and then we're done. So, I probably won't be running the Sandworm Trial a ton, because it's just too easy to bother. But we've got a weekly ten pull. Here we go. Let's just see what we get out of curiosity before I end this video. Oh, we got a red. And a last well. <laughs> oh my god, Mazurka. Mazurka! Well, I'm ready for next month's Dark Visions at least. <laughs> oh jeez, Mazurka. Really? Really? Unbelievable. Oh well. It's 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 a free Neo Vision. And another Riku. Okay, well that was something. Um okay, so I will see you guys for something else later. See you next time.